Oh, hi! This is Aaron Johnson, and welcome to my channel. And uh, I wasn't been uploading videos for many, for many days because I was so busy working with other projects. And today we're going to do is discuss about um, dreams what I have since long ago, but those are dreams what I have right here that are focused on these dreams that really got me inspired to um, create something new or in some cases stick with this format of my dream. However, what we're going to do is focus on a dream involving a subway train and a subway system. Okay. Some people right there may have a question about why I had this type of a dream involving a subway system. Well, the following factors are you must have taken a subway in the past or in some cases you've been on a subway train. However, the dreams what I have are extremely unique. And in some cases, the subway trains what I have in my dream are definitely amazing and some are designed subway trains so before we go further uh, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to click on the notification bell so you can be notified of new videos so y'all can consume more content when I create content or free time so, be mindful of these doors, because we're taking a trip to our dream world, where subway trains are very unique. So, now it's time for a question about what people have. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's time for a question what people have. Why these subway trains are different than the ones we are familiar with in New York City? Well, in our dream world, the subway trains are altered. Although, if you've been in the underground subway and you're taking trains and you go through these tunnels, your mind may record it if you're a child because when I was a little boy that dream was so prevalent however some people who have a dream of a subway train or underground subway may be scared because they may have fear of trains also known as hydrodrome phobia it's also not only to fear railways and trolleys. So, in a dream what I have, the subway train right there may look like it's unique. But it is unique. But take a look. Take a look at an A Express train for this instance. Well, that train right there uses a Vintage style rail cars with horizontal lines from one end of a rail car to another. These roll sides, it was routinely rebuilt. And it has like a picture window port where a driver can see through, like a window, you get an upper one and a lower one. It's always it's also prevalent on Redbird too. Oh, excuse me. Anyway, if you ever take a look of each rail car in your dream that focus on a subway rail car, it may look like it has three sets of doors or two sets of doors, but in a <clears throat> excuse me. 
But in a dream world, you only have two sets of doors. Because the train uses a longer waiting time. However, in New York City, they prefer three sets of doors for the subway system, for the IRT, and three to four sets of doors for the IND. Because this is the reason why our subway system in our dream world keep rebuilding these trains because the theory is they want to make sure they save money and they want to make sure what to keep their subway system unchanged. But they did retrofit all of these modern features like abilities to um, announce each stop without need to announce yourself. However, it uses electronic speech that is used for speech synthesizers. In a real world, a new technology trade in New York City is now prevalent because of the design, but in our dream world, they're catching up. But at least they've rented some of these um, rail cars like these. And they try out for a trial version for the pilot program for the beta channel. However, they managed to keep their older rail cars so they can expand from one city to another or offer a premium approach for the people who prefer the older style of these trains. But it got retrofitted with new technologies. While new technology trains are just more basic because they want to make sure they can catch up. However, the rail cars are always silver in color. But it isn't always the case because in the year 2007, there was a pink and white version. White on the top and pink train on the bottom. And this is the reason why they want to add this because they want to attract more customers. But there's another one, white on top, orange on the bottom. Because how is that possible? Because in our dream world, they don't have Redbird rail cars like in New York City. What do they do? They still just design their own cars. Well, subway rail cars with their designs. And what they do, they test out platform gates and platform screen doors to enhance safety in their platforms. And of course, enable trains to to run faster and ferry more customers. However, they connect their subway system to windmills because a coal burning plant doesn't make a subway train system green because coal is black, not green. Coal is fossil fuel, not green energy. In New York City, they have 22 or more lines. However, they're still connected to a coal burning plant. What's the point about taking a subway train but despite it connecting a coal plant right? because a coal plant doesn't make a subway system green. A coal plant causes a subway system to pollute more because subway trains are a green transit but coal plants, what subway trains are using are green because coal plants burn fossil fuel. In a dream world where I have like there these rail cars right there are always the same and they're left unchanged. However, they kept adding new rail cars right there as a bit of program and make sure each of the lines are unique. However, the reason why they use underground service is because up on the streets, on the surface, more traffic is dwindling because of a dropping fare cost. And people have parked their cars at special park garages to take a subway. Because the city in our dream world is extremely huge. And that's more than enough. To cover the entire state of Massachusetts. However, our dream will match the plant trees and make sure they have green spaces and parks. However, 
our dream world right there have reduced automobile dependency because they're going back to streetcars and trolleys and trams and they're using more bicycles and riding more animals and in some cases they're using a subway as an everyday transit but people can't resist the subway system because of the designs they have and of course the underground services they have but they do have an underground restaurant an underground gymnasium and they do have an underground city a city beneath a city and that is more than enough to offset the cost of housing for the people right there who are poverty or homeless but many of the homeless right there got their own homes down on the ground because in our dream world they care about efforts to reduce poverty but thanks to the way how the subway system right there has been implemented that really caused the shares of all the good industry in our dream world to go down and that also caused the asphalt streets to be look like they're abandoned, but cyclists are using it, and now the drug tracks are coming back. Although our dream world may look like New York City, just like what I grew up in since childhood. Well, if I go back to 2006, wait a minute. How is it possible to have a subway station below your home? Because typically, a subway station is below a business building, not a residential building. Because that's not the way how it goes. But you can still access the subway system that's away from a residential area and go down underground. Because what you should do, you take a train. The reason why I have this type of this forum because people right there start taking trains. Even the Palace Now Dream World has a subway system down below. Although a subway train what I've taken since long ago is mirrored in my dream. And now it's time to take a look of a track system down a track floor of a subway system in our dream world. I know New Yorkers and our people in the United States of America call it a track bed, but in our dream world, it's called a track floor. Well, they don't leave it plain. They decorate with tiles because um, they want to entertain their drivers too. And in some cases, they want to make sure the tracks are easy to see while using work trains and of course they also do art too but take a look as use your imagination see how the third rail is at the center dead center and you see how the rail tracks right there are taller and of course they're extremely thick and in some cases um they're valuable or in some cases, the tracks right there are strategically um, tempered so it can withstand the wear and tear and the high heat. And take a look at that right now. Those are the ballasts right there. But they use the tile flooring as a ballast and insulators. So why did our dream world want to decorate the track floor? And why do you want to make sure the dirt rail is at a dead center or a side contact or top contact or in some cases the customized dirt rail that use induction energy or magnetic connection to charge the train up or power the train. Well, in our dream world, they came up with a different approach of powering the rail cars. But you have exotic rail cars, they implement compatibility setup too. But the dirt rail itself is more like a side contact, but it uses a special harnessing system that shuts the power on or off when a train is present. 
In New York City, they use a top contact dirt rail system for a subway. In our dream world, they came up with a chance solution to make sure the power is shut off in case someone falling down to the subway tracks. But if any objects are lost in the tracks, it must be retrieved immediately because a train will not enter the station until the tracks are cleared because you make sure nothing is lost down there. It must be retreated immediately. That's why you see many people right there working down below to make sure items are retrieved like usual. However, there are parts of the subway system That's been screened off with a platform screen door to enable people right there who are disabled to um, steer me on the platform until the train comes up. Unfortunately, in parts of our dream world, you may need to cross the subway train tracks in order to go to the other side. You want to go to you know, a train bar on our platform. But he must have developed a level crossing system. That is strategically modified. But during she in our dream world. They do the track walk. Or in some cases a track run. As fundraising to keep the subway up and running when they have unused platforms and stations and tunnels. However, they take this very seriously. They fill it up and they add a subscription to it. Once you're satisfied, they remove the subscription and then keep it as free. Or they keep it the way it is with two tiers. However, in our dream world, A subway system is extremely humongous, about 20 times the size of a New York City subway. And that's more than enough to span from Topeka, Kansas to Kansas City. And that's more than enough. to cover the entire state of New Jersey. Despite their ability to plant trees, they came up with a different approach of planting trees by setting up special green roofing. And they've also implemented green spots to reduce air pollution. They've also planted wildflowers to help reduce floods. The subway system itself does have a flood protection module. It's a powerful pump that literally recycles water and debris. That subway system, what our dream world had, is a fierce recycler. But there are two ways to pay fares. You can recycle or you should or use normal currency. Well, you can recycle or use normal currency, brother. Like, you don't believe it. That subway system, what I grew up with, is an extreme. But many of the employees there don't actually just drive trains. Sometimes they put objects together, they put things together too. And he also hire scientists to study how subway subway systems actually work. I mean, they also hire scientists to find out. How does a subway system actually work? And what's special about 
a subway system in our dream world there are many people who are rat owners and they owned fancy rats and also in our dream world this is a reason why our subway system never stops growing because what they do they manage to snake an underground tunnel beyond city in one location to the another and link it to a town that needs population stability or some cases people who need a subway system or some cases enable tourists to tour a town and that's where the tourist industry grows because in our dream world they use a subway system every day where you just did just let the car at home and then take a subway because they only drive cars if they want to that's why the gas stations begins to lose some revenue and that's when commercial vehicles start to use gas stations and that made it a lot easier for truckers to truck on streets and in some cases That will literally be a quiet street for them. Now back to the subway. So that leads me to a question. Why did our dream world has an ever expanding subway? However, the chances can't resist the customers. Subway transit plays an important feature in our dream world. One, you don't need to buy a car or drive a car or learn to drive a car. You can interact with other people. And two, their subway system also serves as an in-house power plant. And what's special about the subway system is always connected to wind and solar energy. However, with all people taking a subway for granted has really caused to cause only an automobile to slowly go obsolete. If you're about to drive in your automobiles in the streets of our dream world, well, prepare for the highest taxes you have to pay for, along with high tolls, too. And prepare for finding a gas station with long distance. However, it's possible to move your car with a car carrier service. It's also available in the real world, too that carries your car for you from one place to another. Because in our dream world, we use trains a lot. And there's no way to switch to driving your own motor vehicle. But what's special about our dream world is Our subway system does have a train driving simulator as coin operated. And of course, what's special about it these simulators enables a subway system to have a steady stream income.
Although, taking the subway every day and keep driving in moderation helps cut down air pollution. And that is what's actually a topic of my dream since childhood. But, I'm not done just yet. However, I do have another story about me right there who emerged from the subway since childhood. Okay, it's, it usually starts off when I um, successfully exit the subway after I've taken a train from school all the way home. But, why do I have on my screen? Is she paranoid? Well, turns out she is. But, as I came right to that apartment, my mother right there was worried, but she was so paranoid. But, she lost her mind. But, when I pressed that, but on my cassette player, the music played. However, I do have another dream that is literally, 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 literally unusual. So, many of these underground trains right there that are rebuilt each year or during usage and wear and, and wear and tear that really cause our dream world to save billions and even billions of dollars. Now, our dream world has beefed up all of these anti-terrorism measures to protect the subway system against damage. However, my dream didn't have this type of this of this upgrade of security for the subway system until there was a time of a September 11 attack since long ago. And this is a real story. But I heard news about it in New York City six years ago. Although our dream world right there has just joined our time, experience our subway each time they reach the first of September because they want to appreciate their subway system. That's when they dropped all the fare prices to, to encourage people to take a subway. However, what's special about you taking a subway, when you pay fares with subway, it covers a meal to go. And of course, you get to take a ride on a private subway train if you need to go to places on demand. However, around, to, around September 11, 2001, during times when the Twin Towers have been taken down by bad guys. That's times when our dream world begins to beef up security. I mean, upgrade their security to prevent terrorism from happening. Although, this is the reason why many banks and other financial institutions requires to implement anti-money laundering laws, know your customer, and customer identification protocol. I mean, customer identification program to help combat terrorism financing, and of course, combat financial crimes. Nowadays, days, they have a campaign. If you see something, say something. Also, in a dream world, you could virtually hear almost any news about these bad guys being arrested or attempting to blow up our dream world's beloved subway. However, 
I did look up a newspaper about subway damage after the terrorist attack. It was extremely difficult to look at, but it's bad to terrorize a country. Being a terrorist is illegal in our dream world. They take this issue very seriously and they don't condone any loophole be exploited or any circumstances. What they do, just capture terrorists in some cases these terrorists are end up sent in prison for lives or some cases got tasted their own medicine. However, our dream world did wipe out a terror link nation once and they expanded and Striking anti-terrorism laws should have been a lot easier. Also in our dream world, if any of terrorists has been killed off, in some cases, they won. That's when the subway system will expand. But they will not go to stop expanding until they're satisfied with what they have. But they'll plan for expansion for years to come. But what they're going to do is integrate it with a force. I mean, integrate with a force. The goal is to try to make sure the subway is remaining hidden underground as possible. What they do, they strategically buy parcels of land. They avoid volcanic hotspots. And they also avoid Hotspots where earthquakes are prevalent. However, if our dream world didn't use a strategy, a subway system may crumble, and that can be a problem. And what do you usually do? They always have an ample reserve of money stored in special saves. And then he deposits in bank accounts to make sure they save and then he invests their money. It's like a subway system that collects bonds every day. But some people may have this question. Why are people right there owning rats down underground? Well, dog ownership isn't prevalent. And some people own mice. Even some people own rabbits. When people right there expand subway systems, people are always careful not to harm any critter. What well, he said, if you accidentally kill a rat, you may need to ride a rat. In order to be forgiven by the kings and queens of our dream world. Also, in our dream world, our subway system tends to gather more customers because many customers right there take a subway every day to go to work or to school. But what's special about the subway system is an underground city and you don't have to cook your own food because the restaurants are always prevalent. But they don't use gas for a reason. 
They use electricity and induction cooking, and they're always careful. And they take fire protection measures. For people to breathe, they have to make sure the substance has strategic ventilation. And they also add plants too to add more oxygen. And most importantly, they have underground offices where employees gather for meetings. And of course, they do have an integration to hospitals. That's why you don't see any of the motor vehicles above streets except for emergency vehicles like police cars, fire engines, ambulances, including police motorcycles. I mean police motorcycles. Also, a subway system right there is also linked to a temple that's sacred, but they treat their subway system as a sacred form of transportation. And up above, they plant trees there to help reduce all of the carbon. And most importantly, Each time when you take a subway in our dream world, you're planting four trees each time. So if you multiply four trees times 100 people, you'll get a whopping of 400 trees being planted. However, their goal is to surround their town with trees and make sure they they have their town remain decorated with trees on the outside with a road right there that's dimmed a bit so people can tell if they're entering this city that is sustainable this kind of a sustains I mean this kind of sustainable city in our dream world has racked up over 4 million citizens so far. And 4 million tourists and 4 million researchers. However, each day they racked up billions of visitors every day at billions of tourists. And to help prevent overpopulation, they've acquired the inner city with dwindling population. And you also acquired a small town to keep the small town remain intact. They had to loop a railroad track around small towns so people can have access to transportation. These elevated railways also function as underground sheds, or in some cases, awnings to help people get out of sunlight. Unfortunately, our dream world discovered dwindling dairy farms that are going bankrupt and that's when trees are being planted sixty trees indicate a dairy farm has gone bankrupt all 
Although our dream world did have an aging gas surface, but a gas surface is also experiencing dwindling subscribers because we switched the electric. However, they tried to um keep themselves from going bankrupt by switching to biogas. However, our dream world has already swapped to biogas because they want to make sure natural gas should not be used no greater than 25%. Also, our dream world takes pride of choosing renewable energy. Hey, you're ahead of Paris's um, climate deal. And in some cases, they've already cut ties with the oil industry. And of course, they also impose taxes on dairy by 95%. And in some cases, they've also imposed taxes on meat products by 600%, causing the meat industry to have dwindling customers and go bankrupt. Well, this tower there already has all the vegetarians. However, the director is still not done with this topic. People are just worrying about why there's still a stretch of an elevated track despite they're using an underground system. Well, it's just for functional use, also for novelty. Tall buildings are often integrated to these elevated tracks because they want people to have quick access to the subway system. And of course, we want to make sure everyone takes the train with a fly, even if you requested a private subway train transit. Also, they use trams, so that's people call trams or streetcars. If streets tend to get to look like they're abandoned, that's when streetcars come back. However, if you're about to take a city bus, you always take a tram or streetcar first. That's why you see those city buses parking at these elevated trolley stations or underground trolley stations or below underpasses. So, our dream world right there relies on public transportation because they believe driving vehicles we you own aren't necessary, but you can still make money driving transit vehicles for public transportation. However, Unsold automobiles are often converted into makeshift chassis for tram systems along with our transit vehicles. Because none of unsold automobiles go to waste. That's market of these automobiles has been reduced so people can have more time with public transportation. That could also help offset costs of building cars if you're a manufacturer in our dream world. 
How, and, and, <clears throat> excuse me. And speaking about our dream world, in year 2006, I was on the way to a restaurant, there was an oil spill because the car experienced a problem with an oil tank, or in some cases it was a gasoline spill, but they managed to neutralize it. However, the car I was in was a transit vehicle that's public while it's going places. So, we think about a subway system in our dream world. Do you have a dream what I have? Let me know at the comments below. If you like this video, leave a like and share it to your friends via our social media platforms of choice. If you want to further support my channel, subscribe. You can also donate via PayPal me or via Cash App by using the links at the description below. So that's a topic focusing on trains within our dream. Within a dream what I have, rather. A dream I have since childhood. 